do you know you have a problem and you need a digital detox? Well, if you're watching this right now, you're probably pretty tech savvy, you got lots of different devices, and you may be somebody who is in need of a digital detox. It's when these devices start to control your life as opposed to making them easier. The area we find this, this impacts your life the most, and this may surprise you, but it's in fact your sleep. You find that people who are using their devices so close to bedtime, it creates an arousal in your brain that is so profound that it makes it much harder to go to sleep. It also affects your circadian rhythm overall. That's your sort of normal rhythm between light and night, and, and when that is disrupted, it just throws off your whole, your whole sleep schedule. Well, one thing you don't realize is that simply by reading an email or reading a text message in the middle of the night, it can take your brain from zero to 60 very, very quickly, and that brain is a very, very hard brain to slow down. It's generally a good rule uh, not to be checking the phone, uh, certainly in the bedroom or around the bed before you go to sleep. One golden rule that most sleep experts agree on is if you do get woken up by the phone or by something else and you're awake, get up and walk around. Don't come back and lie in the bed until you're truly ready to go to sleep. So take a break, put on the out of office, put the cell phone away. Could help you live to 100.